So we are going to take a water break. I bought these Velcro stickers and I'm just putting them on the puzzles because these puzzles, they would literally just fall off and um, I thought this would just be easy. The back. And they just now Velcro on. I feel like that's much easier for her too. And just to find the spot it's supposed to be in. Okay, so that is her B. So now we're doing the lion. That's what we have so far for the lion. So the lion's mane was really narrow. So I just did one side. I could do two sides. I might do two. But let's see if we need to. So I was in the middle of uh, taking down my hair, but I just wanted to talk about the fit of this Garnier um, Fruitis Moisture Mask. So it's called the Moisture Balm by Garnier Fruitis. The fit of this mask is amazing. Now, you know, I usually use the Image, let me pull that out, Image Eye Mask. And this thing is amazing. I feel like anything with like Japanese ingredients, Japanese water, all of those things are just phenomenal. Everly, get out of there. Look at her. Get out. Um, but here in Canada, it is literally double the price. And I'm not paying $68 for them because we're trying to save our money. I just went across the street. I'm like, okay, what can I get? In the meantime, we'll be home in 11 days. And I picked up this mask. I don't know how it is yet. This is my first time using it. The other two that I used from Garnier, they were pretty good. Were they Garnier? I don't know. They were pretty good, but I just needed to rave about the fit of this mask. It's wonderful. So, we have our first family Christmas shoe. Um, and I saw this dress at the thrift shop and I loved it. And I was originally thinking it was like a white sweater, but I had this green one here. I don't think I like it, how it looks like on camera. So I'm like, hmm, maybe this could be for actual Christmas. Yeah, I don't know, like I know. This combo's working, but is this like Christmas outfit or is this like Christmas photo outfit? I was thinking like some high boots. And then maybe like a white sweater. I think a white sweater would work better with this. Just to get an idea. A white top on. But this is a large, but I felt like it was gonna be small. I don't know if the person like hemmed it or what, but it fits kind of perfect. The hips are a little tight. So whatever it is, it wasn't really hippy. But I just like a white sweater. I think this would be cute, like a white sweater like this. Shoulder or something, just lose and like some high boots. So super cute. Ready for the next piece? Yes. More. Another piece. Okay. Just gonna pull it from there. Good job. High five. So I added in the nutritional yeast. I just added in a little bit of butter because I wanted it to thicken up a little faster on me. Um, some more salt, the noodles, and now it's just gonna work down for a little bit. Honey. 
Ja, da. So we are going to take a water break because usually when I'm doing stuff like this, I either forget to eat or drink water or something and by the end of it, I'm exhausted. So I'm definitely thirsty right now and I definitely haven't even brushed with my teeth or washed my face yet. And I've been up for like six hours. So I just made some oat milk for Everly and I put them in my key day pouches. This is what she's gonna drink tonight and in our refills. So I have about an inch of water and I'm gonna put in my apples now. black bag it's gonna be super heavy so maybe some things from there I'm gonna put in there and now I don't even know where to finish um, maybe this bag which is like food and toys kids have so many toys it's like and I always think like dang if I didn't have those cloth diapers I could definitely be using that space or something but for one thing, at least we're saving the ocean. <laughs> what? Now I'm loading the applesauce, which is in here, into the little pouches. Um, hopefully, maybe I can show you and it not die really quick. Our flight was at 8 a.m., so we ended up calling the Uber and all that around 6. We got to the airport around 7, 7.30, kind of late after we finished getting all of our bags checked in. When traveling and packing snacks for your kids, you always want to make sure there's some fibrous foods or foods with a lot of water just to make sure they don't get um, constipated along the trip. And you don't want to just give them like chips and salty stuff, especially because of the air pressure in the plane. So the energy balls and applesauce are great for everyone. <laughs> we were heading to our connecting flight, but they stop you before customs because they make sure that all of your bags have been checked and are in Montreal before you can move forward. And our, all of our bags were not, so about 30, 15 minutes before our flight was about to take off, they let us go through. How you are you? Emily, do you see yourself? The 11 bags that we have in the car. 
How does it feel to be a transporter of 11 plus luggages? I love it. <laughs> Take them all back. I carry you. <laughs> Whoa! Push this. Just push it together. You want to fit, you want to fit in the middle? Alright, Dad, we made it to went from and to Winnipeg. Back in Jersey. Back in Dirty Jersey. East Coast, where we from? It's crazy, man. I don't know if you want myself out here. Got the dopest Uber driver. Figured it all out. Everybody else would say, call another one, call another one. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. You hungry? You wanna eat? Eat. Mommy's eating up some food. Baby girl eating up some food. Coffee. <laughs> How you gonna take it on my mouth like that? No. <laughs> We're gonna write your name right here. Ready? Let's go. E V E R L Y. Everly.